And we're back. With the spring music, and it has been a while since I've heard it. Alright. <sighs> Let's get to it. One thing I forgot to do last episode. Uh, I managed to catch this between episodes when I was fishing. Yellowtail. The name Yellowtail is actually used for a number of fish. This variety is said to bring good luck. I'm hoping I had the footage in there somewhere. I'm hoping I remembered to, you know, record it for the 20 seconds or whatever. But I have two extras. This one is shipped. So that's good. This is how you make it so you never have to worry about uh, your pet wolf destroying the monster spawner. Skill up. Level up. Level 15 obtained. Uh, obtained? Level 15 obtained. So, uh... How dare they? <laughs> I wanted to try to get to level 15 before we moved on to the next part. So I'm really glad I managed it. Without grinding too much either. So I've been thinking about how I want to do this. And there is no correct way to marry them. <laughs> so, I figure... What I'm going to do is I'll just marry them probably alphabetically, except for one of them. So I'm going to be hitting up Alicia first and marrying her, and then showing off each of the scenes. So I hope you guys enjoy. The Crystal Ball. Alicia, will you marry me? Do you really mean it? Of course. I want to marry you and make you happy. You do predict a happy future for us, right? Of course, I predict that we'll live happily ever after. Do you... Do you, Kyle, take Alicia to be your lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold in sickness and in health? Do you promise to love her until death do you part? I do. Oh god, we heard Kyle talk! Oh no! Do you, Alicia, take Kyle to be your lawfully wedded husband to have and to hold in sickness and in health? Until death do you part? I do. Aww. I actually really like that. That looks super cute. And also a little bit like Ray, so that's concerning. <laughs> then seal your marriage with a kiss! By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Well, you've made your vow, so that just takes care of the easy stuff. Now you just have to be good to each other for the rest of your lives. Go ha ha! I'm stunned you got married, and I'm sure you're going to say that you predicted this. Of course, my predictions are never wrong. Well, for this one time, let me predict your future. You're just going to say something bad, aren't you? I'm sure that a long and happy life lies ahead for the two of you. Mother. You do your best with your fortune telling, too. Thank you. Aww. I'm pleased for you, dear sister. Mother finally accepted your fortune telling. Yes. Be happy together. Of course. So Alicia's finally getting married. What a wonderful day. Alicia, congratulations on your marriage. You must be so excited. Congratulations, Con Alicia. I'm sure you two will be super happy together. Congratulations! I wish the both of you a wonderful future together. Congratulations! I know you two will have a happy life together! Congratulations! I'm sure the only 
that only wonderful experiences await you two. Congratulations, you look beautiful, Alicia. Here's to your future. I hope you're happy together, humans. Kyla, Alicia, congratulations to you both. I hope you two be very happy and many wonderful have many wonderful adventures together. Congratulations on getting married, Kyle and Alicia. You guys look great. I know you two will be ha together forever. Uh, my sincerest congratulations to the both of you. You two really look great together. I'm sure you'll be truly happy. Congratulations. Hope things work out. Oh, Alicia, congratulations! Ah, uh, my congratulations to you both. I wish you eternal happiness. I wish you my... I wish you my sincerest congratulations. Congratulations to the both of you. I hope you guys will be happy for together forever. How make you the happiest woman alive, Alicia? You already have. Good morning, darling. Oh, I still can't believe that we're married. It is still a bit like a dream, Alicia. <laughs> So this is where we're going to live from now on. I know you'll make me happy, darling. I saw it. Of course. And now you live in this bedroom over here, with no safe station. Instead, this weird mirror, which we'll get into another time. So you can still sleep over here, but why would you? Now, I want to do one thing. I've mentioned that I will be showing off each of the marriage candidates. What I don't think I've mentioned is that we will actually be canonically marrying Mana. She's the canon girl for this game, and certain dialogue things kind of, I guess, just make more sense with Mana. She's not my favorite girl. She's an absolute sweetheart, and the game pushes her heavily. But we'll get to that later. Because of that, I want to show off one thing with Mana now, and then a thing with every other girl later. So, yeah. Alright, now that we've married any other girl and we come to see Mana, if we take the engagement ring and give it to Mana. If you have this, then that means you defeated my father? But you're already married, Kyle. Too bad. Yeah. It's a simple thing, and it lets you get rid of the things, all the marriage items, and get some unique dialogue. We'll show that with Mana now, and we'll show it with every other girl later when we marry Mana. So, I'll see you all in a minute. Cecilia's final request. This is the most important favor I'll ask of you. Alright, let's go meet her. I've been waiting for you, Kyle. Did you bring the round stone? Uh, um... Whoops, I forgot it. Do you think you could go back and get it? I'll be waiting here. Yeah. May I have it? I'm glad you remembered it. Alright, the round stone. I wanted to tell you something, Kyle. When I was small, I liked collecting stones. One time I got lost in a dungeon while looking for some. The person who saved me from that terrible place was a man called Raguna. I remember you saying you and he were friends when you lived in Cardia. 
After seeing how handsome and how brave he was, my life changed forever. From that point on, I always imagined my future husband proposing me in a dungeon or other monster-infested area. That's... that's interesting. That's one of the weirdest things I've ever heard. <laughs> that's not strange or anything, is it? No, not at all. Well, it's not exactly normal, but it's not so weird. Do you like girls who are a little strange, Kyle? Excuse me? No! Yeah, you're right. Who in the right mind would ever like someone like that, huh? I'm sorry, I think I'd better go home now. Yeah, she's still at 10, but... Uh, we're not gonna do that. Yeah. I do. Really? Oh, Kyle. Um, will you marry me? Cecilia? Oh, you have no idea how happy I feel. How long I've been waiting to hear those words. I promise I'll make you happy. I believe you. Do you, Kyle, take Cecilia to be your lovely wedded wife, to have and to hold in sickness and in health? Do you promise to love her until death do you part? I do. Do you, Cecilia, take Kyle to be your lovely wedded husband, to have and to hold in sickness and in health? Until death do you part? I do. That's super cute. Then seal your marriage with a kiss! By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Well, you've made your vow, so that takes care of the easy stuff. Now you just have to be good to each other for the rest of your lives. <laughs> Congratulations, Cece and Kyle. I'm sure you two will be very happy together. Upset Cece, and I'll make you pay, human. See you. So, Cece is finally getting married. What a wonderful day! Cece, congratulations on your marriage. Be happy, okay? You two look great together, by the way. Congratulations, Kyle and Cecilia. I'm sure you two will be super happy together. You look beautiful, Cece. I'm so happy for you. Ah, Cece, congratulations on your marriage. My reading of your future was spot on, wasn't it? Congratulations, Cecilia! I imagine you must be very happy! Congratulations! I wish the both of you a wonderful future together. Congratulations! I know you two will have a happy life together! Kyle, Cecilia, congratulations to you both. I hope you two will be happy and have many wonderful adventures together. Congratulations to getting married, Kyle and Cecilia. You guys look great. I know you'll be together forever. My sincerest congratulations to the both of you. You two look really great together and I'm sure you'll be truly happy. Congratulations. Hope things work out. Ah, oh, Cecilia, congratulations!
My congratulations to you both. I wish you eternal happiness. I wish you my sincerest congratulations. Congratulations to both of you. I hope, I know you guys will be happy together forever. I'll make you the happiest woman alive, Cecilia. You already have. Good morning, darling. Oh, I can't believe that we're married. It is a whole bit like a dream, Cecilia. <laughs> So this is where we're going to live from now on. I know you'll make me happy, darling. Of course. And... yeah. It's very cute. But it never happened. So I'll be making one change to how I've been doing it the last couple times. I... There are default responses for everyone. And then there are the people who are directly related to the people. Now that we've seen two different perspectives and we've gotten all the default responses, I will be going in and just reading off the ones that are unique. Otherwise, I'll just let them play through, and if you want to read them, you can. Good morning. Good morning, Kyle. I'm happy to see you again today. Um, Kyle? Thank you for talking. Yeah, okay. The Blessing Pendant. Let's do this. Here, Dorothy, I want you to have this pendant. This... just... what... what is this? This pendant has the power to protect you from any and all misfortune, Dorothy. I really want you to have it. Oh, Kyle, thank you. I'm very happy. There's something that's been worrying me. I feel strange when you're around, Kyle. Strange how, exactly? Like, my heart suddenly starts beating fast. Hmm. Everything suddenly goes white. Hmm. My throat suddenly goes dry. It's like I'm about to fall apart. Is there anything I can do to help? I don't know. I don't know if anything can help me with this feeling. So it's incurable, is it? Dorothy, I think I know something that would help. Dorothy? Try holding your breath. How about trying to hold your breath? I think I'll just pass out. You're right, sorry. Here, you can have this back. Will you marry me? If you're always around me, I'm sure you'll be able to overcome this. That's the only treatment I can think of. Oh, Kyle. I know we'll be happy together. Yes. Kyle. I love you. Oh. And now... Here comes one of my favorite ones. Partially because she's my favorite girl, and also partially... She's just so cute in this. Do you promise to love her until death do you part? I do. I do. She's so cute, though! She's just so cute, though! It was the thing that she didn't want to uncover her eyes because she was, you know, afraid of how she looked. She's so cute! The, like, pink eyes and everything. She's just so freaking cute! <laughs> Dorothy's the girl I married in my first playthrough. And I stick by that. Dorothy is such a good girl. And I will... There's something to talk about later on in the game after you marry either Dorothy or anyone else. And we'll get into that later. But Dorothy is so freaking cute. Then seal your marriage with a kiss! By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife! Take care of my- Take care of my sister, Kyle. If you make her sad, I'm gonna wallop you! <laughs> Don't worry, Cammy. I'm sure I'll make her happy. Yeah, I'm sure you will. You are super Kyle, after all. So, Dorothy's finally getting married. I'm impressed that someone as sh shy as she managed to pull it off.
Congratulations, treat her well. I'll make you the happiest woman alive, Dorothy. You already have. So sweet. Good morning, darling. Oh, I still can't believe that we're married. It is also a bit like a dream, Dorothy. <laughs> so this is where we're gonna live from now on. I know you'll make me happy, darling. Of course. Super cute. But it never happened. The Memento Ring. Wow, what a beautiful ring. Is that for me? Yes, Julia. Take a closer look at it. Hey, isn't this... That's right. I had the ore we found together made in this ring. I wanted you to wear it as a memento that time that just the two of us shared. This is... Oh, don't tell me. Are you? Um, I'm just showing the ring off. What, you were just teasing me? I didn't know you could be so cruel, Kyle. Go on, get out of here. <laughs> yeah. But that, no. <laughs> this is how I feel about you, Julia. I want to be with you, Julia. You are, you're proposing? I love you. <laughs> that voice, that voice is worse than mine. <laughs> I love you. He really does sound like a himbo! Will you marry me? Marry you? Well, this is a little sudden. Hey, just don't get mad at me. Oh, you fool. But thank you. I'll make you happy, I swear it. Will you marry me? Oh, Kyle, yes. to love her until death do you part I do I do she's pretty cute too So Julia's finally getting married. What a wonderful day!
I wish you my sincere- oh, he doesn't have unique dialogue. Hundred rose bouquet. A bouquet of guestial roses. What a fiery crimson color. They're beautiful. This is like a dream come true. Rosalind, will you marry me? Kyle, do you? Do you love me? I do. More than more than life itself. I love you. Yes, I feel the same way. Kyle, I will marry you. Thanks. Come here, my darling. Rosalind, you're my queen. Kyle. Do you promise to love her until death do you part? I do. I do. I think that's pretty cute, too. Ah, oh, Rosalind, my beloved daughter. I hope you'll still come and visit me every day. Father, of course I will. Oh, I promised myself I wouldn't cry. <laughs> I'm Rosalind to enjoy your new life with Kyle. Thank you, Father. I know I will be happy. Brother! Isn't this wonderful, Rosalind? Your dream came true. Yes. Be happy forever. I will. Thank you, brother. I'll be watching over you. So Rosalind's finally getting married. What a wonderful day. Congratulations, Rosalind. I imagine you must be very happy.
UA swap ticket. You're here to use the swap ticket, are you? Go on then, Kyle. What do you want? Hmm. I changed my mind. Oh, well, if you want anything, just come and find me. I'll be waiting. I want to exchange it for you, UA. Which is weird. I, um, God, does this mean you're p p p p proposing? Yes, UA, I am. What I want, UA, more than anything you have on sale is you. Please, UA, will you be my wife? Oh, this is all like a dream. Of course I accept. Thank you, Kyle. I know we'll be happy together. Do you promise to love her until death do you part? I do. I do! I actually really like that look on her. I think it's very cute. I'd say that Yue is one of my favorite girls just for the marriage thing. So you is finally getting married. She's hardly ever around. I'm impressed that she pulled that one off, to be honest. The engagement ring. If you have this, then that means you defeated my father? <laughs> no, things didn't quite work out that way. But he did give me his permission to marry you. That's wonderful. I'm so happy you... I'm so happy, Kyle. I'll make sure you stay that way. Do you promise to love her until death do you part? I do. 
do? I do. Man, I can't believe it. My little girl all grown up and married. Well, I... Well, I know I didn't make it easy, but congratulations. Thank you, Father. I'm sure that Kyle and I will be very happy together. You'd better be. Kyle, if you ever upset my daughter, I'm gonna pound you into the ground. You don't have to worry, Father. I know Kyle is gonna treat me right. Good morning, darling. Oh, I still can't believe that we're married. It's still all a bit like a dream, Anna. <laughs> so this is where we're gonna live from now on. I know you'll make me happy, darling. Of course. And that is the canon thing. From now on, we're gonna be married to Mana. Now, the girl you marry doesn't matter. It is all about who you like the most. I will be going for mana because there are some story things and some girls that you choose that would conflict, I guess, in a way, with future things, and it doesn't really matter, but I want this to be one consistent thing as best as possible. Now, mana. She's the only one I did not comment on their looks or anything. I think mana is extremely cute in her wedding dress. I just... With everything, I think there's just so many oddities to this game. I think that some girls looked better in the wedding dress than others. I think there should have been a bit more variety. Mana did look pretty good in that. I'd say she was maybe my third or fourth. She was the middle, pretty much, of them. So, Mana. Hello, darling. Oh, darling, just has the newlywed ring to it, doesn't it? <laughs> 
And as you may notice, it is actually the fourth now. You take a day to get married and then take another day to wake up with your wife. So, yeah. I'm gonna go and check on my crops and everything, take care of that, and then I'm gonna give out every single one of the marriage proposal items. So give me just a moment. Now because we know that it takes two days to do that, it is risky getting married during the summer. If you get married during the summer, then you have the chance of a typhoon coming in and destroying crops and things. So be sure to save before you try to propose, or else you could end up in a bad state. It can still happen during the other seasons. I believe there is a spring one that can happen. I know that a huge storm can come in during the fall, and that a blizzard can happen during the winter. So just be mindful, save, be smart. The crystal ball. Alicia, will you marry me? I'm flat out of the proposal, even if my fortune being is wrong, you'd still want to marry me, right, Kyle? That doesn't make any sense. What? That's very important to me. I want you to have it. You may need it someday. You got the round stone back. Okay. Well, I guess you can't get rid of the round stone so easily, but there's the dialogue. A bouquet of guest jewel roses. What a fiery crimson color. They're beautiful. This is like a dream come true. Rosalind. Thank you for your kind words, but aren't you already married? Polygamy is illegal, you know. Is it? Wild. Like, I get that some people may not like it, but illegal. Wild. Is that for me? Thanks. Sh wow. This is past its use by date. I wish you'd given it to me a bit sooner. Well, you didn't specify it had to be a marriage thing. I could just be like, hey, yeah, um... Can, can you, like, open up a trade route or something? I don't know, man. A present for me? Thank you. You know, I... I wish it gave a little bit more dialogue there. But if nothing else, I just like to think that Dorothy does get use out of that protection. Because she deserves it. And that's it, guys. N We're done. We're married. We finally have done all these amazing things. And because of that, we're going to be done for today as well. Guys, next time Let's Play Rune Factory 2, we will actually be transitioning into the next portion of the game and starting some serious content. It's pretty awesome what's about to happen. Just know that it's going to take a bit of work and it's going to be very, very expensive. I'll see you all next time, and I hope you all have a fantastic day. Goodbye.